Meanwhile, in the UK, British Korean War veterans gathered at the National Memorial Arboretum in Staffordshire. And our reporter, Ben Godfrey, was there. Well, the sun is out this afternoon here at the National Memorial Arboretum, and more than a thousand Korean War veterans and their families have come along to a memorial service here today. And let's speak to some of those veterans now, joined by Albert Baker and Trevor Gooding, the King's Liverpool Regiment gentlemen, uh, during the war. And I know you've got an amazing story to tell. First of all, Albert, you thankfully uh, arrived home with your life. Tell us what happened. Well, after the, I was shot, I was what they call blue on blue now, I, after the treaty was signed, we, it was the 28th of August and we were back in the echelon preparing for the battalion to move out to go back to Hong Kong. I got shot up by accident by one of the lads in my platoon, uh, Ginger lad I call him, because he was Ginger then. And, and this man here, Trevor, Trevor Gooding, Trevor Gooding, actually came to your aid. Tell us what you did, Trevor. Well, there was this man with a huge shot and everybody scattered and then Paul Albert was laying down every hand hardly hanging off and I went to him straight away, you know, just comforted him, covered it over so I didn't want him to see the, um, the damage that was done. And they whipped him into the ambulance then and I took him over to the medical room. And here you are today in Staffordshire on the 60th anniversary mm -hmm. of that armistice being signed, the end of the Korean War. Albert, what does it mean to you to be here today with your uh, fellow members of that platoon? Well, it is probably the last year that we'll be yeah. gathering together for this because the association will be disbanding because we're all getting too old. And it's one day none of us that were capable of getting here wanted to miss. We just could not miss it. And right. I wanted to see Trevor again because last time, last year was the first time I met him in 59 years after him saving yeah. my life more or less. And it was a great day last year, and it will be after this when those beer tent opens, won't it? <laughs> yeah. Friends for life, eh, Trevor? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You only get no doubt about it. Yeah, yeah. All your buddies are friends for life now when we are out there, okay, you know. Yeah, we've lost a few, then we too too yeah. old age and dying, but... Uh, I've read of a thousand British service personnel died during the Korean War up until 1953. Does that stick in your throat on a day like this? It does, yeah. it does, yeah. Quite true, yeah. It really does. I'm glad to be here anyway to meet my old buddies again and, you know, it's great. And pay homage to the, those that have surrendered and given the most valuable thing you can give it their life yeah. for the freedom of others. Yeah. Okay, gentlemen, we could talk for a long time. We'll leave it there. Albert Baker and Trevor Gooding, thank you very much. Thank you. Well, on this uh, sunny afternoon, also a Korean Garden of Remembrance has been dedicated as well. Uh, 150 different trees in it here at the Arboretum each sourced from either China or Korea and tended lovingly each month by the Korean War veterans themselves. From Staffordshire, back to you. Ben Godfrey reporting. It's day two of the London Olympic anniversary game.